Hello students, I hope you all are fit and fine. Today we will discuss about class 3 science chapter 9 on a topic soil. Okay, now let's begin with the topic soil. Soil, we all know that soil is the uppermost layer of the earth in which plants grow. And soil serves as a storehouse for water and minerals. It's needed for the growth of plants. And also it is essential to all life form on the earth, directly or indirectly. Next, how is soil formed? Let us see. Soil is formed by the breaking of rocks and minerals into tiny particles. It is called weathering and it is done by the heat of sun, heavy rains, cold, weather and roots of trees. It takes thousands of years to form a small amount of soil. And the rocks thus take the sap of sand. This is called soil. And the soils contain organic matter formed by dead animals and plants that can mix with these tiny particles. It is called humus and make the soil fertile. Soil contains air and water. We can also prove by attempting some activities. Now let us see some activities. Soil contains water. We need or you need garden soil, metal pots with lids and gas stove. Put some garden soil in the metal pot, cover it with the lid. Heat the pot containing soil over a low flame for a few minutes, then open. With the lid, you will see droplets of water on the lid. It shows that water is present in the soil. So do these activities in the presence of your parents or elders. Now we will see another activity. Soil contains air. We need a unit. For these activities, garden soil, jar and water. Put some garden soil in a jar. Pour some water over it. Then you will see the bubbles coming up from the soil. This shows that soil contains air. The air is trapped between the soil particles which is kept in the form of bubbles when water is poured on the soil. So all this activity you can do at home in the presence of your elders or your parents. Next we will see kind of soil. There are three types of soil. Sandy soil, clay soil and loamy soil. Now we will discuss sandy soil. A sandy soil made up of rough particles of sand. Sand particles are larger in size and there is a lot of space between them. So plants do not grow well in this soil. Such soil remains always barren and dry. And also it is found in desert and seashore. And it is used to make cement and glasses sunny. Now we will discuss about clay soil. A clay soil is made up of very fine particles. These particles are very small that we can hardly see them. And clay can hold a lot of water but less air. And also it is good for making pots, toys and other earthen work. A very few plants grow in clay soil. Next, loamy soil. A loamy soil is a mixture of fine particles of sand clay and humus. Thus, it is rich in nutrients. When plants die in the clay soil, leaves, twigs, etc. drop in the soil and root. As some minerals are already present in the soil, the remains of dead animals do join these two things. Then it makes the soil dark and fertile. It can hold enough water and air for plants. So it is the best types of soil. Next, we will discuss about layer of soil. There are three layers of soil. One, topsoil, two, subsoil, three, bedrocks. So we will discuss now. Soil is formed in a number of layers from top to bottom. Each layer of soil is different. The top layer of soil is soft and dark color. It is called topsoil. The second of soil is light color and full of broken rock pieces. It is called the subsoil. The bottom layer is made of solid rocks and it is called bedrock. So, plants mostly grow in the topsoil only. Now we will see some activity about layer of soil. 
For this activity, we need garden soil, glass jar, water, small wooden stick. Then, put garden soil in a glass jar, pure water in the jar, stir the soil and water. Now, allow it to settle. After some time, the soil will settle in different layers. The largest particles of stone settle at the bottom, above the stones. The next layer is of bigger grains of sand. Over this, we find a layer of clay. Being lightest, humus floats on the top of the water. Now we will discuss uses of soil. Different types of plants grow in different types of soil. The farmers grow crops in the soil. Manure is rich in humus, which makes the soil fertile. These days, chemical fertilizers are used to supply minerals to the soil. Soil is home for many animals, and large numbers of animals make their homes in the soil. This includes insects, worms, snakes, snail, burrowing animals like rats and moths. To know more about soil, let us see here. One can see the different layer of soil by digging it deep. Coconut, cashew nut, dates, granuts, cucumbers, and gourds grow well in sandy soil. Their roots need lots of air. Clay soil is ideal for petty, rice cultivations. Its roots need to be in water. Wearing away of soil by wind, rain, and running water is called soil erosion. And also, protecting soil from erosion is called cultivation. So students, this is the end of the chapters about soil. Thank you students, stay home and stay safe.